Hello, Les jeux YouTube. sont faits. Welcome to Dr. Roulette. I have the prescription for your subscription. Okay, guys, I'm going to be showing you my new strategy. It's called Hit and Run. 31 um, noir. I play this with my uh, two dozen and two column strategy, so I'll be playing both, uh, not at the same time, Rien va plus. Uh, but, uh, but I'll be mixing it around, and of course, snakes and ladders Les jeux as sont well. Faits. Uh, so my new strategy is called hit and run, and for good reason. And uh, I'll explain to you how it works. 24 okay, noir. Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and go even. So I'm Faites picking, um, I'm going to do, let's do 30 cents. So I'm picking Rien even right plus. now. Um, so basically, you see the last number was even. And so Les jeux sont what faits. hit and run is, is that I'm just trying to follow the trend just for one uh, one occurrence. Okay, so that's an even, so that's a win. Okay, so now I'm only going to be playing noir. even, but I'm not going to follow the gravy train. Gagné. I'm not going to go on the gravy train and Faites expect uh, even to come out four or five times. All I'm looking for is one, is one, is one, uh, is one more hit, uh, and then I wait for another spin occurrence. So I'm not riding the gravy train. Um, okay, so let's see here. Okay, so now what I'm waiting for do, I'm not going to bet now. I'm going to wait for my trigger uh, for it to be even again. And then I'm going to bet just one spin that it will be even. So right now I'm going to uh, uh, wait it around. Um, the thing is, you can play this with red, black, even or odd, or 1 to 18 or 19 to 36 with uh, my hit and run strategy. Uh, but... If you do that for for one session, just try to stick on uh, on either one to eighteen, even red, black, odd, or nineteen to thirty six. Don't mix them up in a in a twenty thirty minute session. Your goal is to make, uh, you know, uh, ten dollars uh, per session of twenty to thirty minutes, and you don't want to mix up uh, the strategy. Uh, so you just pick. Uh, for me, I'm I'm waiting for even. Uh, you you just want to choose one for a 20 30 minute strategy uh, the reason why is that uh, uh, it works with the laws of a averages and your probabilities of a um, of, of, of keeping a certain trend uh, so for me it would be even so it would it would be less unlikely uh, that you wouldn't have uh, that you would run into more of a probability chance of your of uh, of not being able to get at least uh, one hit and run okay so that's even so let's go ahead and jump in here so let's do uh for okay we'll do 40 cents on even i i like playing automated uh, roulette uh more uh than wait let's see if that's a hit okay so that's a win all right so once again i'm not going to ride the gravy train and uh, and keep on hitting on even i'm going to wait for another trend to appear um one of the reasons why I like about this automated roulette is that it's faster. Um, so I can, especially when I do uh, YouTube videos, uh, but I find that RPG random uh, random roulette uh, is uh, is easier. Like um, it's easier to uh, to uh, to have the patterns, you know. Uh, I, you know, like the uh, the live one is a bit too random, but I find when it comes to the automated roulette. Um, you can almost like work out the patterns easier. Uh, so it, it, I find it's actually easier to make money on. If that makes any sense to you guys. Okay, so that's a 33. So my trigger is not. So once again, um, if I start another session, uh, then maybe I, my trigger would be black or my trigger will be red or, or 1 to 18 or 19 to 36. But for this specific session, my trigger is on uh, even. Yeah, so that's what my trigger is on for this one. I started, I think, with uh, um, uh, my... Okay, one second. So let's go even. So let's go... Uh, so now I'll put... Let's see, I'll put 30 cents. So this is for low bank rollers, but of course if you have... Uh, if you have a high bank, uh, bank you can definitely put uh, more money... Uh, as a unit, you know, uh, for me, I feel comfortable doing 30, 50 cents, uh, whatever you guys feel comfortable doing. Okay, that's another win. And you know what, I sort of like this uh, strategy more than I like uh, my two to ones. Uh, uh, but I do definitely, oops, I'm going to do that here. 
Oh, no. I was trying to do the first and second dozen, but I didn't have time. But anyways, that was only 10 cents each, so that's not going to really hurt me if I lose. Oh, nice. Oh, doctor. Oh, doctor. I got the, uh, I got the, uh, I got something even better than that. All right. So that was good. I got a street. Uh, I got a line, actually. So that pays uh, 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 six times. So that's pretty sweet. All right. So I think I started this video at $85 and I'm up $1.70 just playing small bets. And, um, you know, um, okay. So, okay. So that's uh, even. So let's go ahead. I got my trigger over here. So let's pull the trigger here. Let's put 30 cents. Okay, so if I lose, I go up a unit. If I, if I win, I go down a unit until I'm flat betting. But right now I'm comfortable uh, just flat betting right now because I haven't lost yet. So I'm on a pretty good run here. And it looks like another win. All right. So, all right. So now I, 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 I would be inclined to go to black right now and follow that trend just for one number to hit. Uh, consecutively is what I'm trying to do but I've I've chosen to do odd so uh, maybe next session I'll do black but it's not good to mix them okay so my trigger point I still have to wait uh, but yeah I, I really like automated roulette um, I find that uh, um, it's less random it's uh, you can almost figure out the pattern much easier uh, my bankroll is at $500, and so far I've made $87. Um, I started yesterday, so that's good. And I, and I do have a couple of uh, home run swings with my, uh, when I play uh, first and second dozen or, or, or the columns two out of three, I'll, I'll sometimes put uh, a zero, so um, as well. So let's see here. So 20. All right, so let's go to even. And I don't, I'm not a big fan on Martin Galing or uh, Mitchell Galing my bets. Um, I believe going up uh, just one single unit and then going down a unit if you, if you lose is uh, much better. Okay, so that's a loss. So that was 30. So let's go. Okay, but now I'm following. Uh, oops. Uh, what am I doing here? Oh. Okay, I'm not sure why... Okay, so I lost that one. So now let's wait for uh, another trigger here. Okay, and okay, so I went back to no, it's uh, still odd. What I do is I usually go from even, and then if I lose, and then I'll I'll increase it by one unit, and then go to um, I'll I'll, I'll go to uh, odd. Uh, but I didn't do that th this time. Okay, so that's even. So let's do a trigger. Um, so let's go here. Even. Let's put fifty cents. I think uh, I think my last bet was thirty. I'm not sure. Uh, but what's good about this site is that you can really practice uh, your strategies and perfect them, uh, and it's minimum ten cents. So if you're a low baller, uh, this is good. This is really good. Okay, so that's a zero. That's a loss. And the thing is, uh, like, uh, so let's say if I do lose, I'll show you um, what's good about this system uh, that I have. Let's see. Okay, so that's even. So let's try this now. Let's do 70 cents. Uh, what's good about this strategy is that it, it prevents you from losing uh, if it goes uh, uh, even odd, even odd, even odd or a long streak. Okay, so that's a, a loss. So now I'm gonna follow the trend, but this time I'm going to go odd. And I'm just trying to get one hit, hence hit and run. So let's go up $1.20 on odd. And I'll, if I lose uh, this one, I'm not gonna keep on going back to e uh, switching even and odd because it can get choppy. So I'm gonna wait for another spin sequence. But I did win that one. So I'm now I'm at $86.70 in profit. And um, so let's just uh, wait. 
for another spin sequence. Uh, so yeah, so it prevents you from uh, losing uh, your bankroll if it goes black, red, black, red, or even odd, even odd, even odd. Uh, and that's why I only do uh, two spin sequences at a time. I follow the same rules that I do when I play two out of the three dozens or two out of the three columns. Same principle. Uh, so right now I'm waiting for my uh, I'm waiting for my even uh, trigger. All right, so that's another odd. So I'm gonna wait. So never play more than two spin sequences at a time. And then wait for the next trend. Right now, I'm just trying to build my bankroll right now. I'm at $86, and um, once I get to a certain amount, uh, then I'll increase my, my, my flat betting to 50 cents or even a dollar. But right now, I'm just trying to build that fire. I'm starting to, I, I want to start to fire. Oops, that one I did 50 cents. Maybe I went a bit too high there. But uh, I'm, I'm trying to get over $100, and then I'll slowly increase it to 50 cents or a dollar for flat betting. Okay, so that is a, okay, that's a win. Well, so let's try to get to uh, $90 and then I'll call it a video. So let's try to do uh, $2.80 in profit. Um, you know, the wheel always catches up to you guys. Um, keep your sessions short. That's one of the keys to victory uh, is to keep your sessions as short as you can. 20 minutes, 30 minutes, have a goal. Have a goal of saying, look, I want to make $10 and then come back to it. I'm not saying you can only make $10 in a, in a day. Come back five, six, seven times and make $70, $80 a day. And if you have a higher bankroll, I only have $500 as a bankroll. But if you have a $1,000 bankroll, uh, then, you know, try to make $100 a day. So my trigger, I'm still waiting for my trigger before I pull the trigger. Okay, so that is uh, Mark here. Okay, still waiting. I'll still be playing the two out of the three columns and two out of the three dozens, but I'm not going to rely on it all the time because it, it takes two units to make one unit. So I honestly prefer playing my hit and run strategy because it only costs me one unit to make a unit. So, But I will mix it in once in a while uh, to give myself a 64%, uh, 65% advantage playing two out of the three dozens, two out of three columns. Uh, once in a while, uh, but I won't rely on it all the time. Uh, hit and run will is now my primary my primary uh, roulette strategy. And also snakes and ladders. One, two, three, four, five. Uh, no, five. I, I would I would jump into snakes and ladders if I had like eight or nine uh, odd in a row. So if that continues, I'll I'll jump in. So Snakes and Ladders is a good one as well. Okay, let's go see here. 31. Still waiting. Oh, I could have jumped in and did the second and third column. If that comes out again, I will uh, jump on the uh, second and third column. Let's go see here. 29, 20, where the column is that? Okay, so let's go even. Let's do 30 cents. Trying to build my bankroll over $100, and then I'll increase the 50 cents to a dollar uh, starting uh, flat betting. 
But at the beginning, it's important, it's so crucial to build your bankroll, to build your profits before you start playing higher bets. Okay, so now we're going to go to odd. You see how he switched there? So now I'm going to just go up one unit. One unit if you lose, and you go down a unit if you win and until you go back to flat betting. So if you're on a shoestring budget, I recommend this strategy. Even if you're a high lo roller, I would recommend this strategy. Okay, there I, I made it up. I recouped my losses and I made a profit. So I give myself two spin sequences. So I follow the trend. If I don't get my even, then I'll go. Uh, then And if I don't get the even, then I'll go to that odd. And if I don't get that one, I will wait, but I'll increase it and I'll wait for the next spin sequence. So I don't get caught in the trap of a choppy, choppy system. Red, black, red, black, or odd, even, odd, even, odd, even. So I want to stay away from that. You have to be disciplined when you play this game. Um, I think that's a 28. Yeah. Okay, so let's do uh, 30. Uh, actually, let's do uh, 40 because, yeah, I think that, that, that will recoup all my losses if I lose, if I win. I'm still waiting to do a two out of three dozen or two out of three row or snakes and ladders as well. Let's go see here. Okay, that's a loss. So let's go to um, odd. Get 50 cents. Now remember, if I lose this one, I wait for the next one. I'll wait for the next even number, but I'll go to 60 cents. Okay, I lost that one. So now I'm going to sit it, sit out. And if I see a, a, a 16 and 19 and 20, oops, let's go play that. Uh, I didn't get it on time. I wanted to put, I want to put, but I'm, now I'm going to do the dozens here, uh, the second and third column to re recoup some of the losses that I had here. Okay, I wish I put more money on that one, but I didn't have much time. Oh well. You have to be quick when you're playing speed auto roulette. Uh, it's much faster than when you're playing with the live dealers. So. Six. All right, so let's, uh, let's do a more of a, a first and second. So since I have higher uh, percentages over here, so let's do 50 and 50, and let's cover the zero. So, uh, so I, I do have some home run uh, chances here. I love when that zero comes out. That's my favorite number to bet whole. I just absolutely love when the zero pops. Okay, so that's a loss. So let's go ahead and um, double, and then we'll go two, $2 on the first and $2 on the second column, and then 40 cents on zero. No, nope, that's a loss. Okay. So you see how I um I stayed away from uh, uh, doing more than two spin sequences. I took my losses. Not that I've forgotten. I'm gonna get. I'm gonna get revenge on my losses. I'm gonna get vengeance on my losses. But I didn't take the revenge right away. 
uh, because I don't I want to get I don't want to get caught in the trap of um, of the column hitting six or seven times. So I'll get my revenge, uh, but I'm gonna wait uh, to get that. And I'll just increase it when I have another spin sequences, uh, when I get an opportunity to do so. I think a lot of people, they lose in roulette because they want to get their, their revenge right away. They want to they wanna be able to make their, uh, the, recoup their losses right away and then double and then triple in a martingale. Um, but you know, like, uh, you know, patience is the key. I'm waiting for my number to come out here. Okay. So 18, so I can, at least I can play even now. I'll have to give it a bit more mustard since I have a lot to, um, cover. So let's go 80 cents. Let's see what's hot and what's not. That's. Okay, let's go see here. Okay, that's a loss. 80. And then let's go here. Cover it for the zero two. Putting a dollar eighty on a dollar ninety on odd and twenty cents on zero. Okay, let's go see here. Okay, got that. Twenty five nineteen. Okay. Let's see here. Never play more than two spin sequences at a time. T seventeen. So right now I'm just targeting even. Just want to get one streak of even at a time. Hit and run. Hit and run. Twenty seven, fifteen, and okay. If the third column comes out again, I will uh, go first and second, and I'll I'll probably do uh, uh, fifty cents, and then if I lose that one, and then I'll I'll go like maybe two fifty or three dollars and cover the zero. Let's see here. Okay, that didn't work. Still no play. Well, let's do snakes and ladders. Well, I'll do. I'll start at thirty cents. So we'll one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So there's been seven odd numbers in a row. So let's go ahead and play snakes and ladders. No, oh, I'm gonna pick it up. Okay. Let's give it eighty cents. Eight times in a row now. Nine times. Yeah, let's go ahead and double it and let's go put 10 cents on zero. Snakes and ladders got that one, so now I'm at. I, I need a. 
I want to get to $90 in profit. I'll call it a video. Well, let's go to even. Okay, let's give it some mustard. Let's go 50 cents on even. Okay, uh, actually, let's go first and a third. And even, and then, okay, so $1.60 uh, on first dozen and third dozen. One, two, three. And then 20 cents on zero. Oh, doctor. Oh, doctor. I got the zero there. So now I'm only uh, $4.40 away from reaching my goal. I love when that zero comes out. Oh, if I can, if I can get a strategy where I can just bet on zero, believe me, guys, I would love that because I absolutely love that zero when it comes out. The most I've ever won on a zero was $850. I put, I think I put like $20 or something on zero and I, it was such a wonderful hit. So now I put 50 cents on zero, on uh, even. Okay, let's see what that is. What's a loss? Okay. So let's go ahead and go uh, 60 on odd. So I'm only going up one unit, okay? One unit if I if I if I um, if I lose and one and go down a unit if I win. Okay, so let's see here. Okay, so let's not go back odd even, odd even in case uh, in case it um, in case it it chops, you know, in case it goes odd, even, odd, even, odd, even. So let's wait for another pocket of train. Let's have some discipline, guys. Okay? That's something that's the hardest to teach is discipline. So let's see if it's going to chop. Uh, okay, so that didn't chop. So, But right now I'm not going to do that because already two even came out in a row. 1026, so... Right here. What's that? Oh, but I know, but I need it now. Um, okay, yeah, so, um, all right. So as I wait here, I'm just going to open up the uh, bottle of wine uh, because we're having risotto for dinner, Italian with my girlfriend. And uh, I'm just going to uh, open up the wine here. I'll still play at the same time. I don't recommend you guys uh, playing while you drink because uh, alcohol can really impair your judgment uh, but I don't plan to uh, drink too much okay so that was odd I'm still waiting for an even okay you're welcome oh it smells so good uh, if you ever had my girlfriend's risotto, it's oh, it's amazing. It's a, it's a really good food. All right, so uh, that's an odd. So waiting for an even. Uh, Thirty-five twenty-nine. I wouldn't mind playing. Uh, if uh, if a high number comes up again, I'll I'll attack the first and second dozen. Let's go see what happens here. Okay, that's a. Uh, Okay, so let's go first and second, and let's do 80, and then let's do another zero, 80 cents each, and then and then uh, 10 cents on zero. So zero comes up, you get $3.60, and, and I believe. All right, so that, what is this now? Okay, 36. So let's try that one spin sequence again. And then let's go up, oops, $1.60 each. And then uh, 20 cents on zero. Okay, what is that now? 
34. Okay, so that's uh, two losses in a row. So I'm not going to go for another one uh, now. Uh, I'm not going to go for another first and second dozen. I'm going to wait for another uh, spin sequence uh, because I don't want to get in the in the in in a in a in a vortex where it comes up like ten or fifteen times in the same dozen. So avoiding that trap. Okay, so twenty. Oh. Uh, this time I'm going to change my my things to uh, my units to fifty cents right now because I have a I have to catch up here. All right, so that's a four a six. Okay. So let's go fifty. Change that. So that is a 20, uh, 23, looking for even. Unfortunately, I'm, I'm recording with an iPhone 8 Plus. Um, so I think I can, I can only keep this session a half an hour or so. Um, pretty much, I think I, I, I might have a losing session unless I can come back here. Uh, let's see if I can do a comeback even. Okay, so put two dollars on even and fifty cents on zero. I'll have a I'll have a stopwatch at uh, seventy. I won't go down more than seventy, if I if I can't get it even there. So let's go see here four. So I got that one. Four two. Hmm. I think I started the video with $85 in profit, so I'm down uh, $4.10. So it might be a losing session, but, uh, you know, I'll come back to it another time. And uh, I will try to recoup my losses. 28.4. You can always make up money. You can't make up time, but you can always make up money. All right, so that's a four. Four, 28, and four. So let's go ahead and jump on the second and third column. Let's give it some mustard. Let's go 250, 250. Let's come on, zero. All right, got that one. So eight dollars and ten cents away. Uh, Twelve and four. Right. I'm really interested in playing. Um, not another slot guy. He's got this uh, amazing strategy. Uh, Mario's numbers. Uh, I'm really. Oh, there's a damn zero. Where were you when I needed you? Um, um, so he, he's got a, a good strategy playing uh, n uh, like uh, whole numbers, like three or four numbers. So I want to watch a couple more of his videos before I do that. And what I like about that is that you do um, a low, uh, you place low bets and then uh, uh, you have a chance of uh, uh, getting getting that home run swing, as he likes to say, uh, which, would, which would be awesome. But I'm a bit apprehensive now until I see more videos on it and really uh, try to perfect it and uh, tweak it a bit uh, for my own uh, my own bankroll and my own customization. Um, so I'm quite interested in that one. Ah, another zero. Mm. Ah. I find uh, when I play RPG, uh, you know, uh, automated roulette, I find that the zero comes up more often uh, than like at the table games. And I find that they're almost compensating for that. Uh, like it's almost works out like a Euro American roulette where they have two zeros. So I don't know. But uh, see how that goes on there. Uh, 
has a 17 and 31. <laughs> okay, there's 10. Okay, so let's go ahead and do even. Go a dollar fifty. Let's go two because I need to play some catch up here. If I lose this one, I'll go to odd, but only go up one unit, so I'll go three dollars. Okay, got that one. Okay, so now I wait. Yeah, so as I mentioned, I, I don't recommend drinking. Uh, uh, if you're having alcohol, I wouldn't mention uh, drinking more than a glass because uh, you treat this job as a profession, you know, as a second job. And alcohol extremely impairs me uh, where I do reckless uh, bets. And also the type of music, too, I listen to. Uh, I love rap music, but uh, when I play roulette, uh, I don't like it because I can go out of control and, and, and uh, go a bit wild, you know? So I stay away from rap music. Uh, do that. Okay, so let's go here even. Got that one. Oh, no, I did I go? Oh, I must have done that one. Okay, so now I'm at $4.60. And $13. Hmm. Still no play. I like snakes and ladders. Uh, but I like it to be where um, I get like, uh, like you know, s at least seven uh, blocks before I switch to red for snakes and ladders uh, before I start playing that. Uh, so it is a good system, but it's, th it's definitely not something I can wait to play often because, uh, you know, it takes a long time uh, for that pattern to emerge, you know, especially when you're doing a video. So... I really do like hit and run, uh, but today I, I haven't. I think I'm I'm started where I started this video, so I haven't uh, really did well on it. But uh, you know, sometimes some days some sessions are like that, and as you see, I grind myself back. It's a grind. A lot of these roulette strategies is a grind. But it doesn't matter how you start; it's how you finish. Okay, so that's a six. Okay, so let's go uh, even. Okay, that was an odd. So let's go and, and uh, double that up and go odd. If I lose this one, I'll wait for another spin sequence. I won't keep on going odd, even, odd, even, because it might it might chop. So I'm going to I'm going to uh, be careful about that. Let's see here. OK, that's a loss. 30, 21, 6. OK, so let's go play first and second and let's cover the zero. Let's go four. So I'm doing four dollars on the first and four dollars on the second column and then a dollar on zero. Oh, doctor. Just when I needed thirty six dollar hit. You see on the top left corner, my balance now is one hundred and ten dollars and ninety cents. When you bet on that zero, you can turn that zero into a hero at any time. Okay, guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. Uh, give it a thumbs up.
And uh, thank you very much. And uh, gamble responsibly, guys. Take care.